guys. Um, so today I've just got the panel adjustable panel bar through from Gizbab. His logo is on it somewhere there. Um, it'll be back to front because I've got the camera the wrong way around. But the um, yeah, I've this is um, I actually bought the full handling package from him, which consists of the panel bar. Um, front and rear upper strut brace and the front lowest brace and yeah and then the pan up but but um i've known he had done for quite a long time so um i just asked um basically if he could send the pan out bar so that i could get the car um wheel alignment done um so uh, i've got the pan out bar and then the braces and stuff should come soon um so this is it uh that's his logo there it's difficult to pick off on the silver but yeah um it does does them in silver black or red um i just went for the silver because i just think it looks really clean um but yeah it's, it's really good quality look the welds on it is absolutely perfect um yeah and then yeah the finish is, finish on it's really nice as well um but yeah all it all it basically does is um if you imagine that's your brace and that's your axle like that going across the bottom that's how it like i know this is not a very good example but um basically if you think when the suspension travels up that arm pivots on the axle like that and basically it shifts the whole axle that way um to one side so you'll probably notice when you lower a micro it'll all start scrubbing on one wheel arch and not the other um because basically the whole the way it pivots the whole axle just shifts to one side um and then yeah um this bar is adjustable in the middle basically so that you can pull the axle back set back to center at its new ride height basically um so that's what we're going to do today i'm just going to go and whip it on now i'm going to try and get it on as quickly as i can and hopefully get it into tracking this afternoon so that i can go on and take it on track tomorrow um but we'll see how it goes um this here is a standard bar um, i'm not gonna do a super detailed video on this because i'm in a bit of a rush but um yeah that's the standard bar as you can see mounts on the chassis the mounts on the axle and then as it pivots up that obviously if it's if it's here the point of connection is going to be further this way and then as it pivots up it moves that way um which in turn moves the whole axle to the side um so yeah that's basically what i'm doing i'm gonna pull that off there's just a nut on here and a bolt on that side uh just here and then the bar will come out the axle will probably drop down a little bit and then um yeah and then i'll just swap it with the other bar so that's the old bar there compared to the new one i literally took two minutes to come take off i just literally took the bolts out and it came off so i'm um, just gonna whip the other one on now and um, i'll show you what it looks like when i get it on it all on uh, it looks really good um when you put it on you want to slot this side on first and then just pivot it up into there um and just make note that this um the hole in this side is is bigger so make sure you get it the right round way right way around um uh, yeah, so bigger hole on this end, smaller one on that end. And yeah, that was it, I just put it on. Um, you wanna put it on adjusted to the same length because it, it's really hard to push the axle over. So it's easier to put it on at the same length and then adjust it once you've got it on. Um, I've just pulled it slightly over, but I'm going to get the car aligned now anyway. So they're gonna, um, that hopefully they'll just pull it back to wherever it needs to be. Cause off, honestly, you're just guessing when you're trying to do it by eye. So, um, yeah, that's it. Um, hope you find it helpful. Um, I'll do another video when the rest of the braces come. Uh, um, I'll do a little bit more detailed video with those because um, I'm in a bit of a rush today. I, I, I didn't really have time to do a video, but um, I thought I'd just do a little quick update. Um, hope you've enjoyed it. Uh, make sure you give the video a thumbs up and um, subscribe to the channel if you want to see more of the micro.